Hello everyone, it is I, Blood Rocution, or what the fuck? Michael just disappeared, where the fuck did he go? Oh, it's night time. Well, this is a pleasant surprise, night time. Okay, what's on today's agenda? Beat some people up, um... Ew, what's this? Uh, okay, let's um... See what crazy ass Trevor is up to, and uh, let's see uh, what's going down over here. Over here. Hush now. Oh my god, not again. Alright. Really? What the hell is going on now? Ah. Uh. Ugh. Come on, really? What's going on now? Don't be a dick, bro. I'm trying to look out for you. Just give me the keys. Whatever, Dad. I'm totally fine. Just had a couple of beers. What are you talking about? We had like six shots each. Look at you. Will you two just make out already? Yeah. My work is done here. Nothing to see here. Nope. No, sir. Hey, can you give me a ride? Just so Boy Scout there can get his buzzkill back. Give that a ride. I'm. What is wrong with you? You guys, that's what's wrong with me. Jesus Christ, go get your own ride, you fucks. Ah, <laughs> 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 oh, man. Oh hoo hoo, look at that car. We hear you're a competent repo guy, yes? This is kind of like a little hobby of mine, requisitioning the underappreciated possessions of my mm -hmm. contemporaries for some wealthy communists in China who will value them much more. <laughs> what? Robbing my so-called friends, Slick. Why? Why? Because they have things nobody else has, because they can afford it, because frankly, I'm rich enough to do whatever the fuck I want, and you're poor enough not to ask me any goddamn stupid questions. Wow. Now, I mean that as a friend. Namaste. That's a nice fucking speech about the value of friendship. Oh, of course, you must be the creepy one. That's coming from you, please. Mmm. What's going on? <laughs> You're going to dress up as traffic cops, and you're going to rob two trust fund kids that I know and dislike intensely. Uh, why? We can get a good price for the vehicles in Asia. Look, complete the work, you'll all be well paid. You're late, sugar <laughs> yep. So what's going on? Oh. oh, you finally get to realize your childhood dream and dress up as a cop. Mr. Weston's research team suggests the two boys like to ride on the Sonora Freeway. What the fuck is that Sounds guy manageable. doing? Hey, you two get going. Ooh, let's go, T. Duh. Dog, I don't know if this shit is for me, homie. My life's already way the fuck out of control. All you right, just got bro. a new house for free. Shut I'm up. A Darwinist brother, all right? <laughs> some prosper and some struggle. Now, are you out of your goddamn mind? This is your lucky break. Choose. Now, are you going to do this, or have you simply found your level in life? Hmm. I guess we'll find out. Yeah, I guess we will, homie. Get in the car. Okay. Nice car.
Okay. Um. Let's see here. Right. Oh. Hey, Frank. Hey, I'm nearly with these dudes, man. You guys comfortable on your end? Yeah, I guess. We look pretty ridiculous. <laughs> All right, man. Look, I'll see you soon. Yeah. We'll pick you up coming through Grapeseed. Get the drivers there and get them going at speed. Hmm. Oh. Not sure how I feel about this. Oh, how convenient. Gun store right off the highway. And a gas station. You, That's a recipe for disaster. Who the fuck does 2.7? Hey, Chase. how about we see which one of you two is for real? So get in your cars and let's see if they move as fast as your mind. Ooh. Ooh, the fool wants to race what? us. We were just getting out of here anyway. All right. Race to cars. Oh, shit. I didn't even realize I was playing. All right. That's so this kind of shit. They try anything funny, we'll shoot them up. Hmm. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. That's pretty cool. I like how they add that. Oh uh, my god. Oh, come on, dude. Here, um, see you, bitch. Coming up now, man. Beat it in a few seconds. Got it. <laughs> oh, here they come. Well, I'll tell you about that later. <laughs> oh, shit. They're too far ahead. We gotta catch up to them if we want them to stop. <laughs> this one's on the wrong side of the road. I'll stay on him. Now come if you can handle it. Nah, I'm fine. Stay on this side. <laughs> this is weird. They don't look like they're stopping, we gotta get closer. Oh shit. Oh my god. Now we gotta stick with them, they gotta stop sometime. Yeah, they really do. I don't think they can, uh... I'm on them! I don't think they can keep at high speed without running high gas or something. Then again, they, they just the got gas, so... We're coming back for you! <laughs> <laughs> Something tells me this isn't working. Oh, Jesus Christ. We got him! 
Sweet. That's not how I park. Okay. Whoa, hey, stay in the car there, homeboy. I'll deal with you later. <laughs> Fuck you too. You know how fast you were going? Gee, I don't know, officer. I uh, try to keep it under the limit. Well, you and your boys look like you were drag racing from where we were sitting there, so uh, why don't you get yourself out of the car? Come on. Officer. Officer. This officer. Is entirely <laughs> necessary. Yes, it is. Get on. Come on. Hands on the car. Let's go. Come on. Get out of the fucking car. Hey. Hey, hey, hey. What are you doing? Fucking car. All right, we got to make sure. Get out of the fucking car, you pint sized Damn. Prick. You, you little shit. Get the fuck out of here. Go on. Okay, so I got change it. Hey, man, you know how hard it was to try slow enough to stay with these fools? Let's have a real race. Oh, okay. Now we got the strength to move. Yes. Mm, mm, I know that voice. Hear that? Johnson's Johnson. <laughs> what? Molly Schultz, Senior Vice President and General Counsel to Devin Weston's Holding Company, if that's what you mean. Wow. Oh. Keep talking. I'm enjoying this. Let's assume you're talking about the cars. Bring them to Hayes Auto on Little Big Horn in South LS. Mr. Weston and I will meet you there. Whoa, don't hang up. I, oh, I think I love you. <laughs> I vote we indulge his childish need to play. Besides, it's his head on the block if they get scratched. Devin's lonely lawyer says go to Hayes Auto in South LS. So that's where I'll be waiting. Scratch this car to hell. So probably uh probably got like a 75 on this mission, something like that. And yep, scratched even more. Yep. Awesome. Cause people can't fucking drive. things have happened I guess yep scratched the shit out of this car <laughs> Gentlemen, I love you all. Oh God, this is gonna be fantastic. One kid and two old creeps. Who the fuck would have thought it? Gentlemen, move the vehicles. Hey, gimme five, five, and five. Oh, <laughs> oh hey, just kiss, homie. Boom. Dog, come on, man. You got the fucking paper? Absolutely. Look, you finish the job, you get the paper. But the order was for five cars. If I'm not mistaken, that's only two. Just give me the. Fucking money now! Oh, oh I'm so scared. I really, really am. But you know what? I'm a payment on completion, a work type of guy. You don't like the job? Take a fucking mm -hmm. walk. Like, come on, man. Take a Hold fucking on. Walk. So what's next, man? Well, it's the Z type. Chad Mulligan. Lay it on him, kid. Mulligan's a record producer. He's going through a messy Mulligan. divorce. He's hiding his valuable Mulligan. assets, including the car, so that makes Mulligan. it complicated. <laughs> He'll clock any ground surveillance we run. All we've got to go on is that Mulligan. the car is in a lockup in Howick. So we just go house to house. Not Mulligan. quite. 
We have access to an LSPD helicopter. Ooh. The computer on board can ID pedestrians from a chip in their driver's license. Find Mulligan and Howick. Mulligan. Follow him to the lockup. Someone on the ground collects the car. All right. So, Great. who does what? You are not needed for this job. Phillips, you're in the chopper. Clinton, you're on the ground. Yeah, I don't understand the deal between you two. Yeah, well, I don't understand the deal between you two either. <laughs> but you know what? Life is just one long Very mission. true. Bye-bye, gentlemen, and stay spiritual. Oh, oh and God. Michael, I'll be in touch about your friend, Solomon. All right, good. I can't stand all this yoga spiritual shit. That's better. No more bacon. <laughs> Sweet. Sweet. 70%. Buzz pass. Tight. What? Okay, so I got a lot less on that mission than I thought I would, but whatever. It is what it is. Man, when am I gonna get a paycheck for one of these licks? I don't know, but I have a bad feeling that we're just getting fucking ripped off. <sighs> Typical white Dude, that's your own fucking fault. You wanna be a bitch to people, then fucking, you know, be a bitch. It's kind of fucked up. I mean, no offense, but I mean, it's like really come back. It's like, ow, you're supposed to be a gangbanger. What the fuck? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. What is going on here? <laughs> What's the matter, buddy? Stuck? <laughs> Did he die? What in the world? Yo, you're... You don't look too good. <laughs> oh, man. That's funny. <laughs> oh, shit. Now what's going on? I feel bad for Franklin. Put up your hands and stand where I can see you. All right, you got it, Holmes. All right. You know how to work that face recognition shit already? Well, figure it out. I feel bad for Franklin because I really feel like... Okay, booting up. You can use the stick to move the camera. Zoom in and out. It'll pick up pedestrians carrying the 2012 SA State License. If you target them... Scan him, okay. Like I was saying, I kind of feel bad for Franklin. Public exposure! <laughs> Okay, and your car somehow got there. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I, I really feel sort of bad for Franklin. You arrested my African-American friend for a minor infraction? The LSPD disgusts me! Well, it's not me. 
I mean, there's some bad apples in the department, but any accusation of a racist culture... Yeah, Franklin just seems like he's doing what he can to get by. I don't really think... It's, it's right for... Like, he's really doubting this job, and... God. For real? There we go. Would you look at that couple? Finally, some normal, adjusted, healthy people in this horrible town. There he goes. Come in, Franklin. We've got a positive ID on the suspect. I repeat, we have visual on Chad Mulligan. No vehicle in sight. All right, look, cool. We're looking for his lockup, dog. All right, stay home and look out. Roger that. Hmm. What a shocker. He's got a doggy. I scan the doggy. No. <laughs> hmm. We have lost sight of the suspect. Might have to send pilot boy down to draw him out. Hold on, wait. He should come out from behind that there building. How the fuck do we lose him? He just went under a building. Chill. What the fuck? <laughs> Dude just fucking sitting there drunk. Fucking just sleeping there. Come on. Suspect stop walking. Appears to be accessing a small garage. Alright, alright, this is it. I'ma get the call. Uh-oh. Hey motherfucker! Oh shit! Shit! Oh fuck! Uh oh. Uh oh. What happened? Hey, look, just stay on him, man, and let me know where he is. Oh, man. Suspect sighted going south on Dutch Oh, Pride. man. Suspect going west down alley toward El Rancho. Car going north on El Rancho. Woo, woo, woo. All units be advised, we have a possible joyrider heading west on Howick in a black C-type. Hey, man, you get another cop on this shit. Nah, homie. No, you'd appreciate the authenticity. Oh, okay. Well, I fucking don't. <laughs> Huh, ah, look at this guy. Look at this. This is crazy. I'm gonna show him how to try that thing. Where is he? Suspect back on Del Perro heading west. Frank! You gotta speed this up! He's getting away! Hey, you my eyes, right? Reckless driver sighted crossing Dorset Drive. <laughs> Near the life invader offices. 
Damn, this is crazy. He's turned off Del Perro, down an alleyway. Hey, where is he, man? Lost sight of suspect near a parking garage. Request ground units to investigate. Hey, buddy, lower our altitude so I can see in. That would be great. Let's see here. Gotta be in here. All garage access clear. Suspect is in the building. He's gotta be. I can't see him! Need some help here, flyboy. Where is he? Uh, you can toggle to thermal vision if you think that would help. <gasps> well, you might have just turned yourself a reprieve. You know, I think I'm developing feelings for you. Oh, come. Okay, I'm seeing things a little more clearly. Hey, can y'all still see me? I'm in the middle of the garage, man, right here. Frank on the middle of the car park. Wait, what? Oh, there. Roger, we have visual. Hey, you reading other heat signatures on this level? We got a guy, standing over by a row of cars, middle of the floor. Well, let's see what the fuck he's doing. Hey, that ain't, damn. You do these places stink. Stink-ass <laughs> motherfucker. Man in his car to my right. Who looks like he's on the phone? Fuck, dude could be calling the feds, homie. Hey, it's not him, dog. Right there. I hope this motherfucker right there. is here. Looks like a man leaning against the car to my left. That's gotta be oh. him. This guy. This guy's gotta be him. Ah, doing pretty creepy, but he ain't our creep. Near side of the garage. Yeah, this guy's left. him. There's a man he in just the keeps car. looking back. This better be him. This better be the guy. Hey, that's the motherfucker. Thank you, Trevor Fitt. I know you think this car might be... Whoa, whoa, whoa! It's yours, man. Enjoy! My baby! <laughs> whoa, whoa. What the hell? Mr. Clinton. Hey, Molly, right? I got that car for y'all. That's great. The Z-Type? Mr. Weston will be glad you caught us. He wanted to see it before we took off. We're on the way to his personal hangar at Los Santos International. I'll tell them to expect you at the gate. Alright. Hey, I'm supposed to meet Devin Weston here. Mr. Weston's hangar is up there on the left. Thank you. You know, if this beauty was a woman, I'd have to break my 20 and under rule. Man, I'll just stick to driving, all right? Hey, tell me something. You know how many of these things they made? Uh, shit, like 10? No, not like 10, man. <laughs> exactly 10. Oh, wow, man. You one of them type of dudes, huh? Tell you something. How'd you like to drive a car like this one, man? For real. Like this? <laughs> Or this. Oh, man, right back at me, homie. Really nice. Hey, you know something? You're not like those uh, snowbird retiree pals of yours. You are sharp, man. Man, I'm just looking for a paycheck for my services. No, no, no don't worry. It'll come. It It'll fucking come. come. Right now, it is life lesson time, pal. You have got to wake up to what's real in this situation, bro. Take me, right? I am opportunity. I'm security. I'm fast cars, blow jobs. I got the world on a plate. Those two clowns, oh man, they are the worst kind of disaster that can ever come down. They are a full core meltdown, and you're just standing there soaking up major what? radiation. You have got to take stock, man. Make that call before it's too late. Yeah, all right, man. I will. Before it's too late, man. Eh, uh, yeah. Just take any car and go! Whatever the fuck that means. 
Alright. Whatever. Doesn't make any sense. Alright. Fucking terrible. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna end it here. Like the video, subscribe for more, and I will bring you more. I will see you guys next time. Later.